welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to set up professional email with squarespace and google workspace let's begin now the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials and by clicking the create account option in the upper right corner you can continue with google continue with your business or working email you know what if you click on the more options you can simply continue with apple continue with facebook and by following the on-screen instructions you are all set now once you are here let me tell you that setting up a professional email address with squarespace and google workspace offers numerous advantages for businesses like you and individuals like me because using a custom email address instead of a generic email provider enhances your brand's professionalism and credibility now it reinforces your brand identity and builds trust with customer and clients because google workspace allows you to create email addresses using your own domain giving you full control over your email branding now you have two options in doing that one is just go here in the upper right corner of your account click on the account dashboard now this step might be different from the one that you have but in my case i'm just going to click on the domains or just click on this option right here or the second option is just go here in the lower left corner click on the settings and from here click on the domains and email and as you can see there's an option for the sign up for google workspace on a monthly or annual subscription now when you click on it right now basically there's no google workspace account that is integrated here in squarespace and as you can see you don't have any domains that are eligible for google workspace now from here you might want to click on the uh, get a domain click on it and from here you can get a new domain and using the these all options and obviously one of another method that we can explore is just simply go to google workspace itself now eventually you can try google workspace for 14 days and take gemini for a test drive while you're at it now these are the most popular which is i am using right now which is the business standard that's ten dollars a month but you get to have all these custom and secure business email 150 participant video meetings and recording a two terabyte pooled storage per user security and management controls and standard support which is paid upgrade to enhance support but if you wanted to test the waters you might want to go for the business starter right that's going to be five dollars per month and from here you can take advantage of all these perks and benefits but if you wanted to scale up and wanted to try the enterprise you might want to contact sales for pricing because from here you need to speak with a sales professional they would give you a live demo on how you can take advantage of their enterprise and the pricing but i tell you it costs a lot so you might want to consider that before you dive into the enterprise um subscription plan now since i have the business standard i will show you how it looks like now this is going to be my google workspace admin dashboard as you can see i have all the gmail's familiar interface combined with the custom domain email address and it presents a polished and professional image to recipients now this can positively impact how emails are perceived and increase the likelihood of them being opened and read so basically these are some analytics that i can access using the business google workspace as you can see and there's not a lot and you can also check the email log search right here so you can do a lot of stuff when you are on your main account dashboard now i can also go to the email log search and from here i can work along with all of the analytics i have the option for the predefined search and custom search right. and again you can check the google workspace apps monthly uptime and a lot more now again you can start your journey here at the google workspace and i suggest for the business starter which is five dollars and the plan includes all these apps plus featured add-ons which is the gemini ai assistant all right and again if you have more questions just click on the chat button down here 
which is going to be more than glad to get you started with Google Workspace. You have your custom email, video conferencing, document editors, and more for your organizations. There's a lot that you can do here when you work on the, uh, if you set up your professional email with Workspace and Google and Google Workspace. Now, if by any chance you are lost during the whole navigation process, I just suggest you go here at the Google Workspace Admin Help, wherein there's a step-by-step -step guideline on the scared space, activate Gmail for Google Workspace, all right? Now, here's the reason why you need this, all the stuff that we are um, doing right now. And before you begin, there's a lot that you can do, okay? Now, to open the Google Workspace setup tool, you must use the Google Workspace setup tool to complete this task. And when you click this button right here, what will happen is you will be directed to a new page. Wherein from here, you can have you can invite team members, you can use Gemini to save time, you can make meetings more collaborative. You have recommended apps here. Right? You can do an anything in your files there's a lot that you can do here on your main dashboard all right it's up to you for you to explore right here and from here you also have the access to your apps as you can see in this one right here but remember that you also have the access to the squarespace help center where in signing up for google workspace is easier if you do it here in Squarespace, but before you begin, you might want to ensure you meet the eligibility requirements, right? So there's a lot that you can do, and I suggest you just click on connect your custom domain to Squarespace. And I believe that that's a wrap for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you in the next one.